depends on how the industry, the uh, players in the industry uh, reacts to all these initiatives that are created by the government. So, the outlook of uh, franchising, it all depends on the players. If the players react positively, become more proactive in developing their business, then it will become successful. It will become a much better uh, uh, franchise industry that we have in Malaysia. But if so happen, the players, the industry players inside the franchising industry decides to actually still maintain their old mentality, still maintain their old philosophy, then they will not be able to go. The industry needs to start innovating. Um, and I understand the government is fully supportive of this blue ocean strategy. So they need to start thinking outside the box. They need to start thinking of ways to become market leaders rather than just be followers. So if the players understand the needs of this, understand that the market is more mature right now, understand that there is a need for them to um, uh, take some calculated risks, to be able to expand their business, to be able to develop their business to become even stronger, then I don't see a reason why the Malaysian franchise industry will not succeed. But if the players are just depending on what the government says, are just depending on um, solutions or facilities that are being provided by the government, then you are limiting your scope of, of, of what you can achieve. You're limiting yourself within the boundaries of what the government has uh, indicated to you. You need to be able to explore um, markets or explore uh, the maximize your business to the full potential rather than see sit within your own comfort zone. Because if you do not take the necessary risks to be able to expand your business or do not take the necessary task to explore these new markets that is unexplored then you will never know on what is the potential of your business. My point right now is to, for the, for the industry, to start, uh, one is being independent, two is trying to make yourself innovate, uh, trying to innovate. The reason that brands are successful worldwide is because of their innovative strategies, because of their willingness to, to explore that, uh, that opportunity outside their own comfort zone.